Just Drinking presents Bacardi Black, Ron Superior Carta Regra. Yeah, I know totally Ooh. what that means. <laughs> Bacardi Black, we got it here. Uh, it's in a typical Bacardi bottle you're going to find in most cases. It's got that sweet screw top yeah. lid that we all know and love because yeah. Bacardi's not as cool what, well, as we want them to be. Some of their mid-level shelf. I'm just kidding. I absolutely love Bacardi. Yes. They have a cool little top to it and everything. Yeah, I love the it's bat. Cool. Check out the bat. They the do a cool great logo. Job. Call me. I'll, I'll help you out with advertising. <laughs> <laughs> better, you better read the side of this thing. Read it aloud. Okay, Let's hit okay, it. Here okay. it comes. Emilio. Bacardi. Wow, that was butchered pretty quick. Uh, no, I'm trying to get into um, character. Mill, uh, I'm trying getting into character. Char <laughs> what character are you trying to get in? Uh, Old and confused? You made well, it. Well, there you go. You're there. <laughs> okay, I'm going to start from top. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Emilio. Did I do it? For bold drinks, Bacardi Black is a dark and intense rum. That captures the bold flavors of oak, <laughs> no such thing orange as peel, flavor. and sweet molasses. Enjoy with ginger beer or ginger ale and fresh lime over lots of ice. I'm telling you, oak is a flavor. I'm oak saying. is not a flavor. Here we go. It's a scent. It's, set. it's in black and white. I don't care what it it's says on black the and bottle. White. Yeah, black and white. Well, black and silver. But yeah, you nope. get the point. Nope. What's the smell? What do you think? Just smells like a traditional Bacardi. Yeah, I was gonna say it just smells like a little heavier, but like yeah, a not... little, little, little heavier. It smells a little thicker. I oh. like not anything like crazy. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Get it down. It's pretty spicy. Ooh, dang! You came along, Rob. I am adapting to the spice. <laughs> It's very spicy, though. It, it it does have a little bit of spice to it. I'm surprised they don't really mention that. Yeah, they don't. And I kind of didn't actually plan on it because I thought it would go down a little bit smoother since there wasn't any <laughs> indication. Sure, they put that there's oak in there, but they're yep. not going to tell me it's a little spicy. No, Thanks, no, Bacardi. No, no, no. Um, I personally like it. I like a good, strong drink. Um, That's kind of, you know, a little bit... Gives you a little bit of a punch. Definitely does. You know? Um, so it's a 40% value. 80 proof. 80 proof. We so like, we good like number, the 40%. Good number. Uh, All right, let's get it done. <laughs> oh, seriously. Uh, well, sure. <laughs> that came out fast. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it did. A little bit faster than I anticipated <laughs> there. I just want to make sure you had a full drink. Yeah, thanks. I didn't want you to be short. Thanks. It's I bad. always feel bad. It's if a bad you thing when I don't have a full drink. Right? I know. It's rough. Yeah, it is. I know. It's always a rough night. Sometimes you hit me, so I just... <laughs> I really... I do not. I have never hit you. Not on camera. <laughs> We're never making it through this episode. <laughs> Let's try this thing before we digress even further. <laughs> that smoothed right out. Yeah. Took the spice right out of it. The here. Pepsi is always a little bit sweeter. But the flavor really stays the same. Than the my favorite, Diet Coke. Diet Pepsi's better. Diet Coke. Diet Pepsi. Call me. Call me. Call me. I look so good. Yeah, Pepsi. whatever. As a Pepsi model. Yeah, oh. whatever. Yeah, yeah. So this is a pretty good drink. I actually like it. It smooths right out. Yeah. They do a good job because they, they suggest, you know, they, they suggest some other things here. I mean, to go with, enjoy it with uh, ginger beer. Or ginger ale. I wonder how that would taste. We do should we, try that. Do we have ginger ale? Or ginger beer? I know we don't have ginger beer. We'll get some. Dang it! We will get some ah, and we'll try it. So underprepared. We've got this much of a bottle to give it a shot. <laughs> Price point. What do we know? Price point. How much is this going to cost? How much is this going to set me back? This is going to set you back around, it's, depending on where you're from, it's going to be around 22 to 26 bucks. Okay. So, so about a $25 bottle. Typical above bottom yeah. shelf rum. Just going to yeah. come into that low 20s, mid 20s range. Yeah, mid, mid 20s. Okay. Not bad. Rating it 1 to 10 as a bottle. Five. Five out of 10. Five. Mr. I like Bacardi's. I do. I, I love Bacardi. 10. I do. I Honestly, I love Bacardi. This one, I mean, yeah, I mean, screw top lid. It comes in a very traditional Bacardi yeah. bottle. They didn't change anything with their bottles. 
Uh, it's got just a different label on it and, you know, gave it a black dark look. But it's pretty much the same. I'm going to go ahead and give it a 6 out of 10 because I'm better than Roy Air. <laughs> so a nice 6 out of 10 uh, for the bottling. 1 out of 10 as a shot on its own. How you rating it? You buy a round for the boys with your jalapeno poppers and you're about to do a shot. What are you giving this one? one I'm, I'm going to go... I'm going to go 6.5. I'm going to go 6.5. 6.5? I'm going to give this one a 5 out of 10 uh, on its own. As a, as a shot. It's an average rum. Is what it's you're average. Basically, that means it's right in the middle. It's just an average rum. So it's kind of like Captain. Not quite as good as Captain. Oh, wow. Because you know Captain's my soft spot. <laughs> but uh, I would say this one's a pretty average rum that's just going to... It's going to be pretty typical of what you'd have expect out of a spiced rum. So... Um, as, on its own, I give it a five out of ten. Okay. As a mixed drink, I'm gonna say again six point five. Six point five. Yeah. Really? Yeah. So that's coming from someone that likes a little bit drier rums. Yep. Six point yep. five out of ten. So as someone that likes sweeter rums and something yep. a little more smooth, uh, I'm actually gonna give this one a seven out of ten. Really? Uh, I think it gets better, um, and by better I mean much better, enough to give it two points higher. Yeah, that's uh, good. You know, on a mixed drink, this is something I would order at the bar. So Bacardi Black, make sure that you check your local liquor stores and to check your local bars and make sure to just check online to see if you can get a bottle sent to you. Make sure to check this one out, guys. This is a great mixed drink and one that you would love to share with friends and family. If you think that we're pretty darn cool or you think we're stupid as hell, that whatever, which one ever comes to your mind first. It don't really, really care. Matter. Don't really care. Go ahead and subscribe to our YouTube. Make sure that you follow us on Instagram and like us on Facebook. We'd love for you guys to be a part of the crew. Send us a message of some rums maybe you'd like us to try. Or just tell us how cool you think Roy Air's shirt is. Because this he's, is cool. he's always wearing something so nice. So huh? nice all the I time. I am. I, I try. I he, dress he up just, just for you. dominates it. Dominates it. So with that, Roy Air, bring him home. Always drink responsibly. Never drink and drive. Don't do it. People can get hurt. Okay? And no rums were harmed during the making of this video. Absolutely not. We'll see you later, guys. Take care.